Hello everyone, this is Johnson. Welcome to my part two of uh, the video how to uh, fetch the data from Google Sheet on your Android mobile application. So we are going to the second part. Second part is to create uh, an Android mobile application. So in this part, I will choose, I will change the name into the one that I have put in my um, Google API. So I will say next, choose the API version that uh, uh, fits your device. I'll choose 22, next. Choose add, add no activity and finish. Then the project is being done. So Let's see, after you create the project, and I will copy this part, dependencies, in, in the app build builder file. Remember, this is the app one, not the project one. So I will replace all dependencies, and remember, because my uh, Android SDK version is 26 and the instruction is 25 so you should change all the version based on your Android Studio 25 to your Android Studio version so I'll change it to 26 22 and here the same 26 0 0.2 Then we need to change the Android manifest file. I'll copy from here to here because these are exactly your file name. You don't need to change it. Then open it. The file name. Change like this. Then go to the Java file, the first one, create Java class named main activity. Okay. Then we need to copy all this except the package because the package is just the name of your project. So you don't need to worry about that. Let's copy all this stuff. It's kind of long. Copy that and remove the public class. Copy all the stuff and then make it smaller. Try to remove any device that I have. Okay. And it's running. And remember, when it show up, I mean the first time when you open the application, it will ask you, do you want me to have access on your contactors? You should say yes, otherwise your application will not work. So, it's creating a little snow. Since it's the first time, um, yeah, I think you just need to notice those two things. The first, the name of the package. The second is the version of your SDK. Your version of your SDK. And that's it. Okay, it seems fine. We we'll also call Google Shape API. Remember, allow. Then you will pump up the Google account that you need to use. I choose my Google account. Okay. Let's 
see the raw potential data. From this part. And uh, to open this uh, Google Sheet link, you can find it in the main activity Java file. Here. So you just copy this file, this link, then open in your Google. Browser, and you can get the Google Sheet. There you go. Name Andrew. Andrew, Matt. Andrew, Matt. Alexander English. Alexander English. So that's all. Next uh, tutorial video, I will teach you how to fetch the data of your own Google Sheet. Thank you for watching.